the farm is an agroforestry farm, so meaning it's a combination of agricultural activities and forestry. Uh, one of the motto that we develop in the farm is uh, we are advocating that the old farm shall be a place of abundance and a place to commune with nature. And then uh, we develop also new line uh, regarding the farm, our farm, our life, and our future. From a mere monocropped 2.7 hectare in the sitio of Bulogan Lantapan Bukidnon, in the year 1992, the Binahon Agroforestry Farm has now evolved tremendously. It maximizes the fullness of nature with due respect to its limits and epitomizes technologies related to the adaption of climate variability and climate change. Presently, the farm consists of 10 components, namely the seedling business, from which they source out their biggest income, farm tourism, food processing, organic agriculture, high-value vegetable crops component, herbs and spices component, orchard garden, industrial crops component, ornamental crops component, poultry and livestock component, and transportation services. Naata karon diri sa pinakadako nga component sa binahon agroforestry farm, which is a seedling nursery, the seedling business of the binahon agroforestry farm. The total two hectares, we have estimated stocks of more or less mga 1.5 to 2 million seedlings. Uh, our trees, we have planted almost almost 25 years uh, trees that are present in the farm. It protects directly the community from strong wind. We are saying that we build structure, we build houses in the farm from the trees that we have planted. And then the most important thing on the in support with the sustainable sustainable farming system because the the forest component the the trees and the forest component of the farm are providing a uh, humus compost coming from the leaves, coming from the from the branches, and then they will decompose underneath the, the trees or within the forest floor, and they will be converted into organic matters and good material for organic fertilizer and organic farming system. The farm is being supervised by young enthusiasts who were once on the job trainings of the farm. Being an accredited learning site of the Agricultural Training Institute, the farm has three training halls, two dormitories, and five cottages that can accommodate around 250 participants and guests, as well as a Pasalubong Center. Mr. Henry S. Binahon is the current national president of the Samahan ng Magsasaka Cientistas ng Pilipinas as well as Region 10's president for the said organization. Despite being government employees, they gave up their position in order to engage in farming. They had two children then. I was born in 1992. So, I was born in Hulam Ugkabaw and then with 2.75 hectares na land and then in 1997 we decided to stay in the farm uh, kayod sa taman sa mahimo kay mauman ang among kuan ganang plano to establish really a farm nga unsa na siya karon my brother and i were really exposed to farming ever since and i remember one time our mama would bring us with her to CDO to deliver our harvested vegetables we also experienced failures in monocropping. So, tungod siguro sa kadaghan sa failure ato sa monocrop and sa environmental concerns, nag-decide nag siguro sila nga 
mag-diversify crop para na i-back up in case mag-failure kay tungod sa market and predictability sa market. So, dihan na din may nagsugod nga kanang gatabang na mi o tanong mo fruit trees. So, for karon, no, we are full blast learning site, no, the kanang lagdaan na kanang lagdaan na address na we are accredited by the ATI has exerted effort so that we will be accredited in the as a learning site and then the privilege of the learning site is uh, we are now venue for training sponsored by the by the agricultural training institute and now we are uh, sharing our technology developed in the farm mapasalamaton kaayo lang sa atong mga gagaon Uh, gitagaan ko niya o duha ka magiting uh, anak, lalaki, uh, babae. Kung matinabangon pa sa farm, number two is uh, kung unsay produkto nga naa sa farm, nga amo lang i ihatag sa ilaha, among ipakaon sa ilaha, dili sila magreklamo. Amo mo nakita ang farm madugay nga nina and then katong, katong principle sa success yun ba? Kinsay magpuli sa farm. So sa among anak, nag-agree nga si Mark uh, enroll siya sa College of Agricultural Engineering para siya ang mag-engineering sa farm. Si Perle uh, graduate po siya sa uh, College of Agriculture major in farm pathology. So, Nahimo naman na mo ang farm nga business and then karon nga apil may mga bidding sa public bidding sa mga uh, seedlings apil van rental and other services. That's why si Perle we decided o bansa iya o kami nag-design niya nag-enroll siya sa College of Law So, makatabang siya sa farm, pinagi sa mga legal niya, niya mga legal na mga issues o problema. The Binahon family success proved that yet again, poverty is never a hindrance to success, and organic farming is an elite profession and a worthwhile venture, which would not only give you awe-inspiring income, but a healthy family and environment as well. Sa kalisod sa sitwasyon sa atong farming farming community na binigod sa Pilipinas, uh, maningkamot lang ta, dilita magpatinag sa kalisod, no? Total, ang akong pagtanaw mong sa farm, ang tanan ni mo, Panginahanglan, i-provide sa farm. <music>